Yes people, in this video I'm going to show you how to make some quicksand for your Minecraft worlds. And there's a quite a few tutorials on YouTube going uh, telling you how to make quicksand with Minecraft. But none of them work no more. Trust me, I've been through them all. None of them work. I'll show you exactly what I mean because they all show you to do this right now. All the others tell you to do this if you look. You can see they tell you uh, with soul sand, put a bit of water and then the web. And then they tell you to do this. It did work. Let me just say, this technique did work. But it, uh, Minecraft or Mojang uh, patched it. And it doesn't work no more. So look, they'll do that. And then you'll put a sand there. And you'll see it does float. It, it, it sort of wobbles. You'll see now. Once it actually, wait for it to get down. Oh, come on. Right, so look. It's there now. And that was all fine. And it used to stay there. But if you give it a few seconds... Now it breaks on its own. If we keep watching, if I'm going to keep talking, it's going to do it in a minute. Come on, come on, come on. Oh no, it's not even going to do it. <laughs> there we go. See, it's broke. They don't stay floating no more. So all the other two terminal videos showing you this, it doesn't work. It does not work no more. So, and I needed to come up with some quicksand for one of my adventure maps I've been making on. And I needed some quicksand. So, um, I come up, I literally had to come up with my own idea how to make some quicksand, and I did it, basically. So, let's just go back over here a sec. So, we're here now. Now, this just looks like a normal bit of sand, doesn't it? They, they're not floating, they're not moving or anything. But look at this now, right? Let me just set my spawn point. And change it into survival. Right, and now, look, if we go forward here... Bang, look at that. Quicksand straight down. We're going to hit some lava and it's going to kill us, basically. So, look, it goes down. And this technique I've basically used, I'll tell you that, I've used powdered snow for it. I've retextured the powdered snow. So, look, as you'll see, that is working. Fully working, quicksand, goes down, kills you. And uh, I've managed to, I did this by changing the, uh, the texture of the powdered snow. I changed it to a sand texture, and I also, uh, the UI of when the freeze effect comes on in your hearts, I basically changed them, so it just looks like normal, it does not look like the freeze effect's happening, basically. So, uh, and it's just a simple way around this, and uh, it's a pack I've made, so I'm not going to tell, I know some people don't know how to change textures and all that. So, I've, uh, if you look in the description, I have actually left a link. So you can actually download a quick the quicksand add-on pack that I've made, and it's just um, obviously what I've just exactly what I've just told you. I've just changed the textures, changed the actual textures of the UI, and that is literally it. So if you download this pack, you'll be able to add it into your Minecraft world. It'll work with survival, adventure mode, and it, it's just a nice, simple thing for quicksand because all the other videos, like I said, tutorial videos. None of them work. Like, that technique doesn't work. I've shown you what they all told you to do. And at one time, they did work. It did work. But since they've been done, Mojang, like I said, Mojang have patched it. And they just simply don't work now. So, I like this one. Because, look, if you just look, it's literally... Uh, oh, let me just change back into creative. Um, I've just put a layer of lava, some cobwebs, and a uh, layer of um, powdered snow. And that, that is literally it. And it'll just make you fall through. It doesn't give the freeze effect. It just makes a player fall through. And it just turns the powdered snow into quicksand. Which, it's a nice simple way around it, I think. The, the only bad thing is if you do add this. Obviously, I've used it in one of my adventure maps. But if you did actually add this pack into one of your survival worlds. The only downfall is if you do climb some and you find an icy mountain bi uh, biome. Then uh, you're going to start finding uh, sand blocks everywhere, aren't you? And I just thought I'd try and find an example. Because I've actually not looked at what I would actually do in an icy biome. If you can see, look, that's the only downfall this pack will do. So if you're not bothered about the icy biome, because look, if in the icy mountain biome, it's going to turn the powdered snow, and obviously it's not going to make the powdered snow camouflage. But if you're not bothered about that, and you're just bothered about the quicksand, then 
go for it because it is it's a, it's a good little thing i do like this quicksand it was a nice little way around it i mean i don't know if anyone else has got a better way around this i would love to be able to hear off you and just let me know because this is the only way i was able to figure out how to get around it and make the quicksand happen but like i said i'm all open to options and other other people's ideas if anyone else has got a better way to make this happen without actually spoiling any of the other uh, textures of the landscape but yeah i'm just going to wrap this video up it's nice and short really because there's nothing it was just a quick one i had to make the quicksand which is like i said nice and easy layer of lava layer of cobwebs layer of powdered snow jobs are good and i'm not going to show you how to make the texture pack because i i don't need to i've just already made one you can just download that nice and easy so yeah, anyway, I hope you enjoyed that, followed along, and yeah, make some quicksand in your worlds, people. So yeah, like, comment, share, subscribe, in a bit, people.